I have to. There we go. Can you go anywhere you want to at any time? Are you a being that's of this earth? Are you visiting from some other dimension? Are you here just to see how our world works and operates and how we do things? You hear something? It was a car horn. At least that's what I heard. Temperature's back up to 73.4 on this one. And I got 73.7. Whoa, that's the first word it said in a while. Story. Should story. Are you... Should and story? Yeah, should and story. I don't know any good stories though. My stories are kind of lame. I'm assuming they want us to tell a story. Were you listening to the stories that Matt and I were talking about earlier this afternoon when I came down? stories do you want to hear? See, now that you know how to use that item, that obelisk that's on the table, you can pretty much tell us anything. As long as it's in that data bank, it can translate what you're trying to tell us. Are you okay with that? Is that something you want to try to do? What's that noise? Crickets? Okay. What's that? I don't hear them. That's... Crickets? Yeah, those are crickets outside. No, I don't hear them. I guess that's them telling you, yep, it's the crickets. Okay. <laughs> see, we're trying to listen very closely to see if there's anything that you're trying to tell us. Okay, you can turn it off now, please. Are you able to knock on the glass door, the back door? Can you make a noise with that? It's just stopped altogether right now. See, I couldn't hear the crickets to begin with. You have better ears than I do. I heard that though. Yeah, it's in the back room. Now it's a click in the uh, tap or a click or something in the back room. You're not in my bedroom, are you? Ooh, I just caught a good one. Can you move the, your camera like this a little bit? Because I want to see the shadowing. Like how you have it? Just go like this. Okay, yeah, let's see. Okay. Because I see shadows in the back corner. I didn't know what it was. <laughs> I just caught a good one that just shot from left to right. 
Like it was trying to get out of the way of the view of the camera. Oh, wow. I know you might not want to be seen because that's the feeling that I'm getting. But I still want to thank you for allowing me to see you. Do you, do you try to avoid being seen? That's my stomach. Is it difficult to come into our world? Car driving by in the background. Oh, what was that? That was a good noise coming from the kitchen. That was a good one. I think something moved. I'm coming your way. Please do not be afraid. I'm just coming to investigate what that noise was. Wish I wasn't wearing pants. Too much noise. Can you make that noise again in the kitchen for us, please? That was me. Without the use of these, these devices, are you able to allow us to hear you? Can you say your name out loud? Whoa. That was like right across the middle of my screen. And I don't have dust in this house. Like, and we haven't been moving a lot, so there shouldn't be much. Uh, okay. So I did just see you. Again, I want to thank you. Um, if you can communicate without using the devices. Oh, that's right. Oh my god. That was awesome. Again? Yeah, dude. It came from the millimeter, it swooped down to the EM pump, and then it came back up and dissipated. Wow. Thank you for that, for using that energy to come through. That was one of the best ones I've caught in this house, actually. I can see you're starting to become more active. Are you starting to get used to Joe being here? Are you someone that used to uh, walk this earth before? Are you visiting? Are you stuck here? I heard you in the kitchen.
Is there anything you want to tell us? Is there a message that you want to tell somebody? If there's one thing that you could do, what would it be? I just heard two noises that sound like a panting or a dog or something outside. Did you hear it? Yeah, I think there, there's... Uh, Is it a duck? No, there's... Um, a neighbor about three houses down that leaves their dogs outside. I wasn't sure if it was something like, sound like too, I, I don't know, something weird. I don't know what that dog Do you like dogs? Do you like cats? Whoa, you got their attention with cats. Wow. Make sure the battery is not going dead on it. I'm coming near it, don't be alarmed. It really saw me off. The battery's on. They drained the battery out of this thing. This was a full battery. I have to turn it off. Like completely. Because the battery's dead. This one's 72.8 on temperature. This device we can't use to communicate anymore. Because the battery is completely drained. But I do have other devices, like the K2 meter that's on the table with the green light. You can use that, the obvious with the words in it. We want to try to use this one that's in my hand to communicate. Okay, so I'm going to set it down and I want you to use this to communicate. If you understand what I'm saying, can you come over here and touch it and make it light up? We have to resort to using this one. If you understand, come please make this call the K2. Can you make the K2 light up, please? We gotta use it to communicate what we got. Come on down. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave you alone with Joe. I'm going to walk down this hallway. Or walk down the only hallway in this house. And I want you to, I'm asking you to communicate with Joe. Directly to him. To show you that he means no harm to you. You're okay with that, right? Yeah, just keep making, seeing what I can get. Definitely. Yeah, alright. I'm gonna walk down the hallway and see if I can't catch anything down that way. Yeah. If I don't walk into anything first. Yeah. <laughs> Where's my trail camera? Right there. Okay, so I'm gonna stay right here, Matt's gonna go walk around the house. And we're both trying to communicate with you, so feel free to come by and say something or make yourself seen or known by knocking on the wall that's near us. You can light up your K2 also, don't forget about that, we're trying to use that to communicate.
Ow. That was me. If you want to use the REM pod, that's over by the kitchen. If you want to use that to communicate, can you go over to that REM pod over there and touch the antenna and make it light up? I hope you guys aren't in my bedroom. You guys know you're not allowed in my bedroom. If you don't want to communicate with us anymore, knock on the wall or make the K2 light up so I know. There was a knock in the kitchen. I heard it. That was me. So what do you think? Conclude it? I don't know. I mean, they're not really coming through right now. The meter that they like is not functional at the moment. They're not coming through on the K2, the knocking that we have. How about this, if, if you don't want us to communicate with you anymore, knock on the wall behind me so I know for sure that that was you, that that is you. Again, if you don't want to communicate anymore, knock on this wall right over here behind me, please. I just cut an orb, like, at the very corner of my screen. Okay, we don't know what to think anymore. Matt, Matt is seeing glimpses of you on his screen, on his video camera. But it doesn't really seem like you're trying to communicate with us anymore. That's what we have with the devices that we have, and we can't hear you. I can't tell whether you still want us to communicate with you right now or not. So, it's getting late. Yeah. Okay, so I think we're going to conclude our session. We're going to stop trying to communicate. Because it's time for me to go. It's been a long day. And we'll come back. I'll come back some other time with Matt. We'll... We'll try to communicate with you again and try to get some more answers and hopefully you'll be more comfortable with me and and we'll be able to talk more and find out what's going on.
So thank you for talking with us and communicating, and, and we'll talk to you soon, okay? All right, shutting off the recording.